If I took my color photograph, desaturated it, and then tried to resaturate it by exaggerating the saturation, what would happen in Photoshop? It would laugh at me. It would just say, dude, there's nothing there. You just took it away. What are you doing here? I'd have to punch a hole in it, and I'd have to do that scenario. This is just a series of math. If I come up here with that plus 100 on top of these flowers, now turning on auto mask, what was the main tip I wanted to make sure you had when you start doing your first brush stroke within using auto mask? Start in the area. Completely inside that area. Don't get close to any edge. So when I come up here, I am completely um, masking out, and even though um, I'm on top of something that has been desaturated, the fact that these numbers m measure back out to neutral, in other words, full color, is the secret, Mickey Mouse Club handshake. Okay? And it's a great concept, because if you wrap your head around that, that's another one of those things where you're going, wait a minute, that means that I can take this out here and add it here, and I don't have to... You start thinking in ways that actually will allow you to do a lot of work. I'm going to tap that Y key so I can see when I spill. What was the other tip that I gave you about working with the um, auto mask? That if you do get spill outside. And if you erase, what happens? It becomes more intelligent. It actually becomes more intelligent. So I'm going to come up here, and I'm going to make it a harder, smaller brush. I'm in the eraser. Why? Because I'm holding down that Option or Alt key. I'm going to now click outside here, and you can see that it's an intelligent eraser as well as paintbrush. I'm now going to come down here. You can also see how quickly you can go, even on things like this. Option or Alt, clean it up. Got it. Thank you. Even this big of a brush, let's come down here, get a little spill. Now, come on. That's pretty darn cool. The brush is twice as big as the tip of the flower, and yet it is staying inside that flower. Okay? What do you do when the software does something nice for you? Say thank you. Okay? Say thank you. That was awfully nice. Because again, remember, when software is buggy, it's because you're copying an attitude, not because the programmer did something wrong. So before, as we know, oops, um, when things weren't quite working right, obviously it's not this version of Camera Raw. It's my attitude that is needing adjustment. Okay, so you can get that. When I get to, you notice that the inside here, some things are just so different that um, it's having a, problems with the inside of each one of these flowers here. So at some point, I just turn off the auto mask and just hand paint in these areas.